Hey, what's up? My name is Jay-Z and I want to show you really quickly how to use a voltage meter to check 220. In this case, I'm checking the plug before I plug in my new electric BMW and I want to show you how to do that to make sure you have the right power. Come over here. So this is a voltage meter, all right? You're going to have two prongs, a red and a black. Here's a 50 amp 220 pl uh, a plug on the outside of my uh, garage here. What we're going to do is we're going to plug the first one in here and plug the second one in there. Now look at my voltage meter. Back up, back up, back up, back up. It says 120 volts, and that's because we're only doing the, the one pole, the one side of the 220 plug. There is four cables in here, a hot, hot, negative, and a ground. So we're gonna do the other side. That will also be 120 volts, okay? Yeah. Yep. Now, if I do the two hots, this is where we should get 240. And there is your 240 volts. So now you know that it's been correct. And if you really want to double check, there should be no power here at all using the ground and the negative. There should be no power using the ground and the hot. And there should be no power using the other ground and the hot. You should have 110 or 120 on this side, 110 and 120 on this side by connecting the negative and the hot wire. And of course, again, the two hots combined equals 240, which now allows me to plug in this BMW and charge that battery and get me that fantastic over 300 mile range. Thank you very much. It's a good way to check the power. Hope you use it to your advantage.